Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome to my Let's Play of Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. Uh, this was originally a game I did back in uh, 2007 and 2008. Um, the reason I'm redoing it is because the original project had very, very bad video quality. And then also because I didn't have commentary as well. And, you know, since most of my videos are now in commentary format, I figured that, you know, I'd redo this project. This project is actually the last of my projects I'm going to redo. Because with this project, there were four other projects I wanted to redo as well. And uh, the reason I held this one off for so long was because I knew this one would probably take the longest to do. And since I have no other projects I really want to do at this moment, I figured I'd go ahead and start this. I should have a lot of fun, though. This is one of my uh, favorite games. I wouldn't say it is my all-time favorite game, but it's definitely up there. It's definitely one of my favorite Mario games. And then, Yeah, it's just always been a childhood favorite of mine. So yeah, the basic story of this is... Kamek, a Koopa wizard, tried to kidnap the Mario Bros. Um, this game obviously takes place way in the past, way before Mario and Luigi became heroes, uh, back when they were only small babies. And uh, so yeah, Kamek tried to capture both Mario and Luigi, but uh, she could, he could only kidnap Luigi, and Mario got away. And then Mario fell all the way down to Yoshi's Island, where he met Yoshi for the very first time. So now, we're going to begin an adventure with Yoshi and Baby Mario. Should be a lot of fun, shouldn't it? Yeah, this game will be pretty fun. It can also be kind of challenging, too, especially for a 100% run, which I am going to do. I am going to do a 100% run of the game. Which should take me quite a while to do, because uh, getting 100% on every level is pretty difficult. Um, uh, a lot of you are probably wondering, because uh, in an announcement video I made, I think it was my uh, 4,000 subscriber special. I think back then I made an announcement that I was thinking about either doing the original game or the Game Boy Advance remake. And a lot of people are actually pushing for the remake, because... Uh, it has a lot more levels to do, but um, I can't find any good ROMs of the game because I actually don't have the game, so I'd have to do it on emulator. I'm doing this on emulator as well, but it's a little bit different since I have this game, and I, I actually have two copies of this game. Uh, one copy that I originally bought, and then the other copy I bought as a replacement when I thought the game was lost, and it really wasn't, so... Yeah, I've had two copies of the game, which is, uh, I've always thought was kind of cool, but, um, since I can't take my Super NES to college with me, uh, this will have to do for now. But yeah, I can't find any good ROMs of the Game Boy Advance version, so I'm just going to use this version, and if, like, later on, if I want to do, like, playthroughs of the Game Boy Advance only levels, then I'll do them later on, but right now I'm just going to do the original game. The Super NES version, the classic version. Okay, so let's see, what file are we going to pick? I'll pick two. Why not? So yeah, this video is not going to be very long. All that this video is really going to consist of is the opening cutscene and then this little part right here. So yeah, this video is not going to be very long. Uh, I'm releasing this video at midnight, but I am going to have another video later on in the day that'll have the first level of the game, because I know some of you guys don't really want to just watch this. I mean, some of you would rather see me actually get into the game, so I am going to have another video later on today, so don't worry about that. Okay, Yoshi, jump two times and then jump into the screen, or off the screen. There we go. Welcome to Yoshi's Island. Uh, this really isn't a level. This is just kind of, you know, getting used to the controls and stuff. Not really much to worry about. 
I'll go over all this other stuff later on because it's probably won't play a factor here. So yeah, you can eat enemies and you can uh, turn them into eggs. You have a jump button, and if you hold the jump button, you can do a little flutter jump, which is Yo which Yoshi is pretty famous for. Uh, you can obviously use your tongue to swallow enemies, and then you can also um, shoot eggs. If no, I can't. Okay, the X button. Never mind. So yeah, you can also shoot eggs. You have a little aiming button, and you can just you know fire them wherever you want to. It's kind of cool because you can use eggs to ricochet off of walls and floors and stuff, which is gives some parts uh, a little bit of challenge, I guess. I really don't know. Oh, I lost Baby Mario. That's bad. You do not want to get hit in this game. You never want to get hit because if that timer reaches zero, then uh, you'll lose a life. And then also, whenever you lose Baby Mario, he screams really loudly, and you do not want that, so... Uh, try not to get hit in this game. But yeah, the arrow's pointing this way, so let's go on. Okay, so we're at the very first, uh, world map. This is where the first level is. We'll be doing this later today. You can also see your score for each level. You can also customize controls. I'm not gonna worry about that. So yeah, I'll see you on later today when I do this first level. This is Slim Kirby. See you guys next time.